This astronomy calendar of April 2023 contains dates for notable celestial events, including moon phases, hybrid solar eclipse, meteor showers, conjunctions, and other interesting events. Most of the astronomical events on this calendar can be seen with unaided eye, although some may require a good pair of binoculars for best viewing. So let's discuss about them briefly. April 6 Full Moon, Pink Moon The moon will be located on the opposite side of the Earth, as the sun and its face will be fully illuminated. This full moon was known as the Pink Moon because it marked the appearance of the moss pink or wild grand phlox, which is one of the first spring flowers. April 11 Mercury at Greatest Eastern Elongation The planet Mercury reaches greatest eastern elongation of 19.5 degrees from the Sun. This is the best time to view Mercury since it will be at its highest point above the horizon in the evening sky. Look for the Mercury planet low in the western sky just after sunset. April 16, Moon-Saturn conjunction. On April 16, Saturn will meet the waning crescent moon. The apparent distance between the two objects will be 3 degrees 29 minutes. It is too far to spot them at once via telescope, but you will see the conjunction with the naked eye or binoculars in early evening in east. April 20, New Moon. The new moon will occur on April 20. At this point, our moon will stay between the Earth and the Sun, so its bright side will be facing away from the Earth. It's the best time for stargazing, because the moon's light won't hinder the view. April 20 Hybrid Solar Eclipse A hybrid solar eclipse occurs when the moon is almost too close to the Earth to completely block the Sun. This type of eclipse will appear as a total eclipse, to some parts of the world and will appear annular to others. The eclipse path will begin in the southern Indian Ocean and move across parts of western Australia and southern Indonesia. The eclipse will be visible from Australia, East and South Asia, the Pacific Ocean, Antarctica and the Indian Ocean, however, not in India. The annual ring of fire will be visible for a few seconds in the Indian and Pacific Oceans. Meanwhile, the total eclipse will only be visible in three locations on land including Western Australia, Timor-Leste, and West Papua. The map below shows the visibility of solar eclipse across the world. Looking directly at the sun without eye protection can cause serious eye damage or blindness. To view the solar eclipse directly and safely, use solar viewing glasses or eclipse glasses or personal solar filters. You can also use pinhole projector to watch solar eclipse. This is an indirect way of observing the sun because the viewer sees only a projection of the sun and the moon. April 21, Moon-Mercury conjunction. On April 21, Mercury will meet the one day old moon. The apparent distance between the two objects will be one degrees 53 minutes. It's too far to spot them at once via telescope but you'll see the conjunction through a pair of binoculars or unaided eye in early evening in West. April 22, 23 Lyrids Meteor Shower. The Lyrids is an average shower, usually producing about 20 meteors per hour at its peak. The shower runs annually from April 16 to April 25. It peaks this year on the night of the April 22 and morning of the 23 April. The meteor shower will be best seen from the northern hemisphere. It will also be visible in the southern hemisphere, but the number of meteors will be lower. Best viewing will be from a dark location after midnight. Meteors will radiate from the constellation Lyra, but can appear anywhere in the sky. April 23, Moon-Venus conjunction. On April 23, Venus will meet the waxing crescent moon. The apparent distance between the two objects will be 1 degrees 18 minutes. It's too far to spot them at once via telescope, but you'll see the conjunction with the naked eye or binoculars in western evening sky. April 26, Moon Mars conjunction. On April 26, Mars will meet the Moon. The apparent distance between the two objects will be 
3 degrees 13 minutes. It's too far to spot them at once via telescope, but you'll see the conjunction with the naked eye or binoculars in western evening sky. Visible planets in April 2023. Mercury, Mercury is an evening planet, best at the start and middle of April. See Mercury after sunset on 11 April and also spot Mercury on April 21, near Moon in west evening sky. Venus, Venus is a brilliant evening object. See Venus near the Pleiades on 10 April and also near waxing crescent Moon on April 23 in the west evening sky. Mars, Mars is a fading evening planet, small when seen, with a telescope. You can see red planet Mars near first quarter moon on April 26 in western evening sky. Jupiter, Jupiter is in conjunction with the Sun on 11 April and not visible this month. Saturn, Saturn is a morning object, but it is not well placed and but if you are trying to view, then see Saturn near one in crescent moon on April 16 in east early morning sky. Uranus, Uranus is a purely located evening planet. You can see Uranus, 4 degrees from Mercury, on 19 April but tricky to see, and near Moon on April 21, in west evening sky. Neptune, Neptune is a morning object, lost in the dawn twilight, so not worth trying to see. Here are the phases of Moon, for April 2023. Thank you for watching my video, please like, comment and share this video. Also subscribe my channel for more space videos like this.